Hi everyone, welcome back. It's the 19th of spring here on Forwell Farm. Salmonberry season is over, so it's time to shift our focus to something else. And I know what I want to do today. Let us see. Weather report? No rain. This is the driest spring in Stardew Valley history. And our fortune? The spirits are somewhat mildly perturbed today. Luck will not be on your side. Uh, that is that is unfortunate, but I think we can work with this. I really, I really hate that we left the mines unfinished. And by unfinished, uh, we stopped on level 85. Uh, level 90, we have the obsidian's edge waiting for us. Uh, so I'd really like to go get that. And not only that, the only thing we need for, the only thing we need to unlock the mine carts is a fire quartz. Uh, so yeah, I really want to just pop over to the mines and get that done. Uh, I'm so tempted just to, to put off the watering and go do that. But I think the responsible thing to do is, hey, Dr. Harvey. Thanks for that medical care free of charge. I think the responsible thing to do is take care of the chores and and then pop over to the mine. Uh, and hopefully it won't be a... <laughs> I, am, I am hoping and praying that it'll be like easy peasy lemon squeezy and we'll be done with it. And then we can uh, turn our attention to something else. But I'm afraid it's going to be uh, torturous. We shall see though. Okay, I'm gonna take care of the chores and I will see you all in a little while. Look what we just got. A bolt of cloth, that's really nice. That's a, a rare drop from newspapers, so pretty happy about that. And uh, yeah, back to watering. Okay, I think we are ready to go. We just need to put our lucky cloth away in our community center chest. And let's get to, let's get to the mines. I have a ton of food here. Uh, not because I expect energy to be an issue. I expect healing to be an issue. So we want to be prepared. We do not want to die. I'm really hoping that we would just will just sneak down and get those levels. But it's not a good luck day. And the the bad luck days can have like a lot of mobs. And you've seen how how poorly we do with that so it should be fun <laughs> or I don't know it should be exciting maybe hopefully it'll be uneventful hey Linus yeah let me just pick up your camp for you a little bit so sloppy there you go that's better Let's stop by and let Linus know that we cleaned up his camp. I'm sure he'll appreciate it. Hey, Linus. Please don't destroy my tent. <laughs> okay, buddy. Take care. Okay. Are we ready? Let's, uh, let's do this. Now, I brought all of our stone, not because I am worried about getting levels, I actually brought it because I'm worried about needing to escape mobs. <laughs> now, if at all possible, I don't want to use it. Um, but but we are allowing for the possibility that we might have to. Okay, let's go. Uh, well, this looks like a good sign. Is there a fire quartz here? Oh, this is promising. Yeah, we're not even gonna bother with you, Mom. Uh, you know, I prefer if we had like a fire quartz right here on this level, but I'm not gonna complain about this. I was really, because it's a bad luck day, I was really expecting there to be mobs. I kinda wish I kept my magnet ring on now. Oh no. You know what, let's just, Oh my goodness. Let's get past all the crabs. Come at me, bat. Okay. 
Oops. Um, apparently this uh, extra fancy uh, club here has a really nice attack for like multiple mobs, like banging it on the ground. So uh, that is something. Oh, how many are there? I really don't want to spend this stone, but I think we should. I think we should. Let's do it. That's why we brought it, right? A hundred stone, though. Still looking for fire quartz. So, you know what? Let's... Let's go around to see if there's one here. There's a ladder. Oh, there's a nice pile of gold. There's that magnet ring. I should probably just keep my combat rings on though, right? I have to say, you know, this is turning out to be a pretty lucky, bad luck day. We need quartz. Fire quartz would be better, but we'll take what we can get. Okay, yeah. Let's go. Too cold from that? Okay, is there a fire quartz? No, no, so this is not lucky. Um, but, you know, we could farm for some gold and see what we can get. We're, uh, we're doing our best to avoid that brute, because he's a brute. You know, I think this is stupid. I need to kill this slime. There we go. One down. And what do we need now? Now we need a ladder out of here. I was so busy looking on a fire court for a fire quartz. I forgot, you know, that we're still like on a mine level. Whoops. Our health is still doing good though, so. Come on guys. Not today. Look how much damage we did just from like that little bit of poor timing. These mobs are no joke, but that's okay. Do we have any bombs or anything? No. Can you tell how scared I am of that guy that I am like happy over here, not mining that coal? There we go. Okay. Good news, Obsidian Edge. Bad news, uh, our Obsidian Edge is uh, really nice, 30 to 45 damage. Uh, much more than our lead rod here with 18 to 27 and minus four speed. This only has minus one speed and plus 10 to crit. Uh, so yes, not bad. Let's duck down here. If it was a really good luck day, I would, um, I would uh, try and push on, but really, I just want to look for fire quartz. And there isn't one, so yeah, this was a waste of time. And that slime is looking to have its way with us. Let's get out of here. Let's regain some of our energy. And I think we can spend, we have a lot more. I think we have like 17 iron bars and like six gold bars. We should um, spend a little bit of time just uh, farming for some gold. Okay, and the level that we want to farm gold on is uh, level 80, 81. Do we want to take, let's, uh, let's see how bad. Uh, much better, much better. Um, they'll still hit us like a ton of bricks, but
Is this a mushroom level? Uh, no, it's just two mushrooms, that's all. No, maybe it is a mushroom level. Oh, this is a pretty stinky mushroom level. Oh, uh, this map weapon makes all the difference in the world, doesn't it? Fire Quartz, we're looking for you. Uh, this make weapon makes all the difference in the world, but you still need to be careful in here. We're only, like, level 2 combat, which is, uh, you know, sh sh pretty sad. Uh, I was trying to, like, keep the rocks by us so we wouldn't have to, uh, kill that slime, but... Okay, let's get out of here. So we have some mushrooms, but we have no room in our bag to put them away. That's fine. It's fine, we don't care, let's go. Come on, fire quartz. Since 1.4, the the mushroom level, can you repeat them? I think they did away with that. So, like, you have to, like, you can only get it once. So what? Yeah, and there is a brute, but is there a fire quartz? Get off me. No fire quartz. Let's get out of here. Look how dark it is in here. It looks like we are, uh, you know, we're failing here. We're getting a lot of gold, though. We have 71 ore already. I guess this is the difference by taking the minor trait. I've never taken it before. Still looking for fire quartz. And we're not going to get it. Which is really unfortunate. But it is what it is. Maybe we'll pop over to... Um, we'll pop over to Clint's in the morning with our magma geodes. Because it's uh, Shane's birthday tomorrow. And see if we can't get one from from these two magma geodes. I think we might have a couple um, other kind of geodes too. You know. Uh, let me sort out our inventory, our chest. We really need to go to the Adventures Guild to empty this out. I'm gonna sort this out and, uh, and it looks like we're going to be passing out. I'm sorry, not passing out. Camping in the caves is what we'll be doing, not passing out. Okay, not the day that we hoped for, um, but we did get an obsidian edge, and we also got, uh, what is it, 73 gold? I mean, that's not too shabby. And I guess we'll sleep right here underneath this lovely pine tree. home. It's a new day. Uh, let's see what is in store for us on the TV weather. It's going to rain all day tomorrow. You know what? It figures because we're done watering pretty much today. Uh, we have a three-day grace period on our strawberries and we weren't planning on water watering them tomorrow anyway. Figures. And the spirits, the spirits are very happy today. They will do their best to shower everyone with good fortune. Uh, we missed a trick. We should have waited to go to the mines until today. 
Uh, we got that bolt of cloth yesterday. So here's Emily inviting us to use her sewing machine. Thanks, Emily. Um, so we didn't do as well as we hoped yesterday, but we did get a nice pile of gold. And uh, we have our obsidian edge right now, which will make the mines so much nicer. Uh, so I'm not upset about that. Um, and we do have these, uh, we have a couple magma geos and we have a couple omni geos. So we can go ahead and take these over to Clint and pop them. Maybe they'll have a fire quartz in them. If not, we'll head back up to the mines. We have to go to town anyway. Uh, for Shane's birthday, uh, Shane is the keeper of the pepper poppers and we would like those very much. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and, uh, take care of our... Do we have one of those for Gunther? I'm not sure. No, we did not. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and take care of our farm chores. It's an even day, so it's mushroom cave day. Uh, so we'll be sure to uh, pop over there and get our mushrooms, crab pots. Yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take care of all of these uh, chores. And uh, let's see, Joja customer service. Uh, since you have no money, we were obligated by law to provide this service for your charge. Thanks, Morris. Uh, yeah, I will, uh, take care of the watering one more time for the last time. And I'll meet you back here when we're done. We also, oh, do you see all of our strawberries? This is our, uh, speed growth strawberries. Now, I messed these up. I, uh, I actually watered or fertilized our ancient seed with that, with that speed grow. Uh, so we missed out on a strawberry and I think if I'm not mistaken I think we missed one just by watering one so I think we're down two strawberries already uh, but it is what it is we'll get these uh, harvested and this will be enough for level four farming and preserve jars so we'll want to do that tomorrow as well uh, so much to do Okay, all the chores are done and we have a bit of things in our bag to sell to Pierre so we can buy Shane a birthday present. And we're gonna come back for those because it's getting late and I don't wanna miss uh, Clint because uh, we want to open up the minecarts, like I've said a million times. So if there is a fire quartz in these geodes, then we don't need to then we don't need to go to the mines. If there's not, then we're going to go to the mines. Uh, but if there is, we're going to spend the day foraging. Yes, we want uh, six kale seeds for tomorrow. And there's the birthday boy right there. Um, and then we want to buy a beer for Shane's birthday. Since it's a love gift and... Uh, that should bring us up to uh, two or three hearts with him, which means that he will uh, share the secrets of Pepper Poppers with us. Uh, but right now, let's uh, let's uh, cross our fingers here. Cross his geodes. Now, we have some other geodes at the house, uh, some frozen geodes, but there's no chance of fire quartz, so I didn't even bring those. Yeah, it looks like we're going to be heading to the mines. Well, maybe not. Nope, there we go. Fire quartz. Yay! That is exactly what we were hoping for. Ah, uh, perfect. Thank you so much, Clint. Uh, let's... It's a good luck day, so let's look in the trash. So that means that just freed up our day a little bit. And now we can do... We can uh, forage. If we go to the secret woods, that should be enough... That should be enough hardwood to get our horse. Uh, which is good. I'm actually not sure if we're going to get our horse or not. I'm uh, kind of toying with the idea of unlocking the bus and getting some star fruit for... For, uh, you know what, let's go to the beach first. Hey, Elliot. You probably wouldn't like it inside my cabin. It's dark and full of spiders. Uh, thanks for sharing. I feel like me and Elliot are getting really close. <laughs> he doesn't tell everybody about his uh, dark 
dark, dirty cabin. I must be special. Okay, you know what? It's a good thing that we, um, that we crafted up that crab pot. We would have been waiting forever for, like, a cockle to show up on the beach. We still haven't got one. And that, those crab pots are giving us, um, some of the quartz that we need to craft our sprinklers. Which is why we were happy to have them. They're... The mines are full of quartz, but of course you have to uh, use coal. And look at this, we have uh, seaweed. We were looking for seaweed forever in our other game. Okay. Now what we were doing, we have all of the forage on the beach, and it is, it's Shane's birthday. Hey, Willie. It's also a very good luck day, so if we can manage it, it'd be nice to look in all these trash cans. Hey, Alex. My arms are really sore, but that's a sign of progress for a guy like me. I must have done a thousand push-ups yesterday. Good for you. And there is Shane right there, and we just have enough for this. Um, we also had a little bit of money in our journal. So, uh, yeah. Uh, yes, you can. Would you like a daffodil? Nice to see you, Emily. Pam isn't responding. I guess it's a good night at the bar for Pam. I love to decorate for the different seasons. There's all kinds of new decorations that we've never used before now. Did we buy him a beer? We did. Happy birthday, Shane. Oh, is it my birthday today? I guess it is. Thanks, this is nice. We're glutton for punishment. <laughs> Why are you bothering me? I want to be alone. Well, enjoy. Happy birthday. Hey, Marnie. Have you been to that strange tower west of my house? We've been. <laughs> okay. Let's go. No time for that. Uh, what are we going to do now? Now, oh, we need to go. Duh, duh. I was so excited to get the crystal, I forgot that we actually needed to go turn it in. This makes such a huge difference. So we'll be able to, you know, just pop over to the bus stop, zip up to the mines and get, you know, stuff done. We can uh, turn stuff into the museum, uh, see Clint, all that good stuff. Lickety split. <laughs> ah, thanks for the geodes. Junimos are so happy. Where are the Junimos, Keepers of the Forest? We cannot skip this or less I would. Looks so good, one room down. And uh, yeah, let's get back to the farm. It took two days, but we got it done. Uh, we checked off Shane's birthday. Uh, we got most of the forage, I think. Um, we have the obsidian edge, mine carts unlocked. We're having a lucky rain day tomorrow. Do you know what we could probably do? Let's see if we can't get, um, some tappers on, on the trees. And then go to the secret woods and get the, do we want to sell stuff? I'm not sure. I think we can hold off one more day before we sell stuff, so yeah, we're not going to. Uh, we'll go ahead and uh, put this stuff in here. Let's get some more gold smelting. Good. And let's do, we have just a bit of wood here five tappers just what we wanted let's get these on our oak trees and then we'll head over to the secret woods even though the night is almost over um while we were while i went to check the mushroom cave i uh, broke some of the rocks around here 
uh, you know, some of the stuff that was in the way. Let's get a tapper over here, and then I'm sure we have four trees over on this side of the farm that we can throw tappers on and, uh, and be good. And that'll be two things down. Tomorrow, we're gonna need a lot of wood though. Tomorrow we have one, two, uh, tomorrow we're gonna want to craft some some preserve jars at all, all possible, and I think it will be possible if we can get some wood chopped. And we should have a little extra time, uh, not much, but a little bit more time than usual because we won't have any watering to do. Uh, but I think I already said that we were we were pretty much done with our watering anyway. Uh, we worked extra hard to to water the strawberries from uh, here we go Shane will give us a beer if we want but we're not going to do that because it's going to slow us down and you guys don't like the cutscenes anyway so which I completely understand because I <laughs> uh, most of them I don't want to see again like, I've already seen them, so it's like... Okay, and hardwood. Once we have our, our horse, once Miss Daisy is back home with us, um, we'll make an effort to come to the Secret Woods uh, more often. But right now, it is such a long detour to come over here that, you know, in the beginning, there's so many worthwhile things that you can be doing with your time. But this should give us all of the hardwood that we need. Could you just chop that, Honeywell? This should give us all of the hardwood we need for... Could you get out of there? for the stable, uh, which is good. And that, so that'll be waiting for us when uh, we're ready for it. I'm holding off on selling any of our crops until we have uh, level six farming, if at all possible, because then I uh, will get a 10% bonus because we're we're gonna go for obviously the tiller option. Uh, will we actually make it to bed if we try? I guess you know there's a possibility that we could. So yeah, let's go home. We don't have to sleep outside every night. I'm sure Honeywell would uh, would like a shower. I pretend that there's a bathroom in our house. Okay, uh, yeah, let's do a little bit more coal, and then that will, yeah, coal, gold. There's more than enough for, yeah, not too shabby. We'll need coal, we'll need stone, we will need a bait for tomorrow. One, two, three, four. We have two pieces of gold here, and let's do copper. So there's, that's our smelting. We have our bait. Uh, we do not need a watering can because, yeah, no more watering. We might have a little bit of watering, but not much. Plop those in there. And we have enough for 18 sprink uh, sprinklers, which is not bad. We only have 23 plots uh, right now. And we have two day, uh, two, three days to, to really get our sprinklers up and running. So, yeah, go to sleep for the night. And here are our mine carts. So good. And we have level four farming. We're gonna go ahead and uh, absolutely craft some preserve jars. We're not gonna go crazy. But I, if we could get five, that would be good. Uh, but yeah, thank you.
thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode and will leave a like if you did. Your likes and comments are always appreciated and they matter. The content you like is scheduled more frequently. Also, consider subscribing if you are new. I'd love that too. But that's all for now. I hope to see you all soon with more Stardew Valley. Bye-bye.